Hi, this is Ron Martinson of ronmartblog.com, and I'm here today to talk about MacFun's popular Luminar photo editing software, which as you can see is now available for testing on Windows 10. I'm going to start by opening up a sample image and maximize, which of course is on the right hand side on Windows, versus the controls that are on the left side for the Mac. I can come in here and open my own file. I'm opening a PSD. Raw files and JPEGs are supported. All the things I typically would do in Luminar are available to me. I'll go click on Auto Smart Enhancer Preset and I'll get some changes applied that make this image look better right away. I could use the side pane to go and make modifications to those changes. I can zoom in and I can fit back to size. When I'm done with my image, I can go ahead and click export, or I can share it on social media or email. Batch processing will be available, but is currently disabled in this beta at this time. I can see my before and after, and I also have a nice little before and after pane that I can use to go back and forth to see the changes as they've appeared. I have undo. And I have a history panel that shows me the things that have happened. I can show and hide my histogram. And I can show and hide my layers palette. Same, well, same thing for the presets to give me a little bit more space. And the side panel. So I can see just my image and have a little bit more space available to myself. On the right hand side I have controls available to me. And the ones that are not working currently in this beta have been hidden intentionally, but the full set of controls will be available in the final version. For the presets, I just like on the max size, I have preset categories, and all that works exactly as you'd expect. This has been Ron Martinson of ronmartblog.com doing an overview of Luminar. Please join me for additional videos coming soon.